Good morning, good morning, Madam Tom. Reporting for exam six. No time to chat, I'm afraid. I'm late, late, late. Hello, dears. Nice and easy one today. You'll just be sitting at your desk answering a few written questions. Comes in two parts. Plenty of time, so no need to rush. However, the student with the lowest score will be joining the dearly departed. Oh, you might want to put these on. After all, this is room 101. I was expecting something fierce and scary and dirty because that's what room 101 is about. You never know what's coming. We shall begin. <laughs> basically making a lot of noise but I really kind of like rocked them out I have like selective hearing now because of the show thank you very much I got new skills now <laughs> but the kids are really trying to piss me off I really want to know their parents their parents seriously I want to call their parents right now <laughs> because they were kids I was just trying to not say fuck you get away from me I was complete chaos like the whole classroom was filled with clouds running over the place and the syrup on the floor and on the tables and then kids are running like crazy it was like shopping at a sale with 1000 crazy women just in your face all the time shouting and screaming and hitting you it's very difficult to concentrate i honestly didn't think that was very difficult at all but you all seem a little flustered I think we need a little something to keep you cool for the next part of the exam. Oh. <laughs> and exam six, part two, begins now. Do you want to write something? And suddenly this huge clump of feathers lands on your paper and you just kind of like brushing it away, I'm furiously brushing it away. The questions are easy, the answers come really quick, and they're very general knowledge. But it's so difficult to know the answer and yet not be able to write it. Goodness, I just leave you alone for a few minutes and this is what happens. You guys just cannot be trusted. Well, let's hope your results are a little bit more impressive. We shall have to see. All of the questions were really tough on me and I was like, okay, get ready, dust myself off and just go. I woke up today trying, you know, thinking I've not won a challenge yet, so I really, really wanted to win this. This is a secret. I got no extra underwear, so later after this, I'm not gonna wear any underwear. So call he's me. lying. He's not even wearing underwear now. <gasps> Don't tell people. Well, all right, four little chickens. Who's going to fly away home? Well, not this one in particular. Back to being in the top place, Ethan. Well done. In a next spot, Kim. Well done, my boy. Looks like we're down to the two chicks left in room 101. <laughs> but sadly, I only have one space for only one of you. Victoria, it's time for you to go. School's out. You may leave the room. Actually, I was kind of expecting it already because I saw the set of questions and it wasn't an easy exam. It feels kind of sad to leave, to know that you are so close. And then there were three. But there's only one action adventure holiday of a lifetime in Australia. Somewhat of a predicament, it seems, since there are still three of you. Pause it now! 